Hi folks, my name is Peter Boykin. I'm running for Lieutenant Governor of North Carolina. You can check out my website at peterboykin.com. This goes out to the remarkable Gen Z community. Let's take a trip down memory lane to a decade characterized by Neon, MTV, and yes, Fabio. Ah, the 80s. Well, sorry, the 90s, sorry. I'm kind of partial to the 80s. But the 90s. A time that holds a special place in our hearts for the younger generation, Fabio might seem like a relic, a figure comparable to our modern-day Tiger King. But let's not forget, Fabio was more than just a long-haired, chiseled Italian heartthrob. He was an em em emblem of an era, a symbol of a vibrant electric time. Recently, Fabio graced us with some unexpected advice, words that resonate with the essence of being true to oneself and embracing authenticity. He said, be yourself and don't drink soy milk. Now, these words might seem simplistic on the surface, yet they hold profound wisdom. Quote, be yourself, a mantra that transcends generations, urging us to embrace our uniqueness to revel in our individuality, and to never compromise our authenticity for societal approval. In a world where conformity often tempts us, Fabio's message echoes the importance of staying true to who we are. And then there's the intriguing second part of his advice. Don't drink soy milk. It's not merely about the beverage. It's a metaphor. It symbolizes staying away from trends or succumbing to societal pressures that might dilute our essence. It's about making choices that align with our values and not just following a fad because it's popular. Now, this advice might seem unconventional, but in its simplicity lies its strength. It encourages us to question the status quo, to be unafraid of going against the tide if it doesn't resonate with who we are at our core. As we navigate the complexities of the modern world, especially with Biden around, Fabio's counsel holds relevance. Embrace your quirks, your passions, and your beliefs. Stand firm in your convictions and make choices that align with your true self. Remember, authenticity is your superpower. So let's raise a metaphorical glass of perhaps not filled with soy milk and toast to being unapologetically ourselves, just like Fabio implores us to. Let's celebrate our uniqueness and march toward and march forward into our feature, uh, future <laughs> with authenticity, individuality, and a commitment to stay true to who we are. God bless everybody. Visit PeterBroiken.com and uh, hopefully get your vote during this uh, primary here in North Carolina. God bless. Peace.